Are you proud of the brand you built? Of course, absolutely. I never thought we would get to the point that we got today. And I'm sure I can imagine what it could be in the next 10 years, but it would be wrong because it's going to be better. Like that's, that's the type of attitude that I have towards this. It's something to be proud of, especially looking at like other industries, not just dental. You know, you look outside of dental, you see companies like Tesla, the rate of innovation those guys have and like how they do it. And then you find parallels between us and them and you're like, oh, well, This is amazing. Like we're we're essentially doing very similar things in a different industry, trying to steer people towards a different option, where everybody else is going the other way around. You know, going against the against the grain, completely against the grain. That has built a brand to some extent. It's like people resonate with that, and people who who look at Sprintray and view it as uh, view Sprintray as like the the beacon of doing this kind of innovation, super fast. At times, could be scrappy. But you have to be it, scrappy. Yeah, it's better than <laughs> being stuck in, in like something for for fifty years. You know, you wanna, you wanna push yourself and everybody else towards a better future. So Jamie is sitting here. Uh-huh. He's our content lead, and mm-hmm. he walked to our office and he said, "Amir, there's a different energy here. Mm-hmm. I thought I'm walking into corporate America, but man, this thing flows. Everyone is very energized. How did you build that culture? So I want to ask you that question." It's a collective effort of all of us, but I think the culture of relentless pursuit of you know something better without having to throw tantrums at people, <laughs> you know, because w- what we do is gets really difficult at times, and sometimes the thing doesn't work. You know, you you spend so much time and energy to make it, but it doesn't work. I mean, for me, part of what I do on a daily basis is I employ a lot of humor because that's you know <laughs> that's just me. We really try to. It's not about who says it. It's about what they are saying. You know, it's like you, it's you elevate yeah. voices, you yeah. elevate people, not not titles. So if you have a good idea, it doesn't matter if you're from, you know, it could be from any part of the company. It's a good idea. So we elevate that idea. So everybody feels that they're partaking in this in this journey. I think the element of humor, being included in decision making, even if we can't make everybody happy, we hear everyone. 